Hello students, this is Amardeep Singh, your computer teacher and today we are going to continue with the chapter number 14, number system and uh, in this session we will discuss about how to convert other base systems to decimal number systems. So let's start our discussion with how to convert other base system to decimal number system. In previous session we have already discussed about how to convert decimal to other base system and the method was the division method. But if you want to convert other base system to decimal number system then we have to use the multiplication method. So first of all we have to uh, multiply the digit with the other base system uh, to the power of 0 then plus the next digit to the power of 1 the next digit multiply by the other base system to the power of n so first we'll discuss about how to convert binary to decimal number system and in this section we'll discuss about how to convert binary into decimal and converting binary uh, binary fraction into decimal number system so let's start our discussion how to convert binary to decimal number system here we are having a binary number and we want to convert it into a decimal base so first of all what we all have to do we have to multiply the first uh, digit from the right side that is 1 into the power of 2 to the power of 0 2 is the base of the binary number system and then plus next the second digit from the right side that is the 0 into 2 to the power of 1 then plus then next digit from the right side that is the 1 into 2 to the power of 2 plus next digit 1 into 2 to the power of 3 so we have to increase the power by 1 starting from the right side the power of the base of binary is 0 then 1 then 2 and 3 now we have to calculate the values 2 to the power of 0 that is 1 1 into 1 equal to 1 plus 2 to the power of 1 that is 2 into 0 the result is 0 then 2 to the power of 2 4 into 1 equal to 4 plus 2 to the power of 3 the result is 8 8 into 1 that is 8 now we have to calculate the sum of all these values 8 plus 4 plus 1 that is equal to 13 so 13 is the decimal equivalent of the given binary value this one is the result of the uh, 1101 that is a binary number and 13 is the equivalent value of, uh, in case of decimal number next we'll discuss about how to convert binary fraction into decimal fraction so as we have already discussed how to convert the integral part of binary number into a decimal so we have already converted this portion 
into the uh, into decimal that is the 13 and now we'll convert the fractional portion of that binary number into the decimal now we have to convert this like and here we are having the procedure we have that we have already discussed that we have to multiply each digit from the right side with the base of uh, the binary number with the power of 0 then to 1 2 and 3 now we have to start the fractional portion from the left side from this digit from the first digit we have to multiply it with 1 into the base of the binary to the power of minus 1 the next plus second digit from the left side that is 1 into 2 to the power of minus 2 then plus the next digit that is 0 0 into 2 to the power of 3 and last one with 1 into 2 to the power of minus Four and now calculate the value one into two to the power of minus one that is one divide by two then plus one divide by this one divide by 2 to the power of 2 that is 4 plus 0 because 2 is multiplied by 0 that means 0 and 1 divide by 2 to the power of 4 means 16 now divide these numbers and the result of 1 divided by 2 the result will be 0 0.5 plus 0 0.25 plus 0 plus 0 0.062 and 5 and uh, when you will calculate all the values then the result will be 0 0.8122 and 5 it will be the result so you have to write this number here 13.8 1, 2, 5. So that is the way how we can convert a binary fraction into decimal fraction number.
next we will discuss about how to convert octal to decimal number system and in this section we will discuss how to convert octal into decimal and uh, converting octal fraction into decimal fraction number so let's start how to convert octal into decimal so here we are having a number 321 with the power, with the base 8 that is an octal number and uh, we want to convert it into a decimal with the base of 10 so again the mechanism in, is same we have to start with the right uh, most digit from that octal number so we have to multiply that digit 1 into the base of octal that is 8 to the power of 0 and uh, next we have to multiply second number that is 2 multiply by 8 that is the base of octal to the power of 1 plus the next digit that is 3 into 8 to the power of 2 now calculate all the values 8 power 0 that is 1 1 into 1 equivalent to 1 plus 8 power 1 8 and 8 into 2 16 8 power 2 that is 64 64 into 3 that is 192 so when you will calculate the sum of all these values the result will be 209 so 209 is the decimal equivalent of the number the octal number that is 321 Next, we'll discuss about how to convert octal fraction into decimal fraction. And uh, we are having this octal value 321.25. So we have already discussed the how to convert the integral portion of that octal number into decimal equal. And now we'll convert this fractional part that is 2 and 5 into its decimal equivalent. So the mechanism is same. So we have to start from the left side that is 2 so we have to multiply 2 into the base of the octal that is 8 to the power of minus 1 plus 5 into 8 to the power of minus 2 and the result is 2 divide by 8 plus 5 divide by 8 the power of 2 that is 64 next 2 divide by 8 result will be 0 0.25 plus 
5 divided by 64 the answer is 0 0.0 seven eight one two five and the sum is zero point three two eight one two and five so here you will write three two hundred nine point three two eight one two and five so finally that is the decimal equivalent of uh, an octal fractional number so finally we'll discuss about how to convert hexadecimal to decimal number system and in this section we'll discuss about how to convert hexadecimal into decimal and hexadecimal fraction into decimal fraction number system so let's start our discussion with the how to convert hexadecimal number into decimal equivalent and we are having a b that is an hexadecimal number and uh, as we know that uh, the value of a is 10 and b is 11 so we have to calculate a and b according to 10 and 11 and so now first of all we have to multiply the value of b that is 11 with 16 11 into 16 16 is the base of the hexadecimal and 16 to the power of 0 plus the value of a that is 10 10 into 16 to the power of 1 now the 16 power of 0 that is 1 1 into 11 means 11 plus 16 into 10 that is 160 and now 160 plus 11 then the result is 171 so 171 is the decimal equivalent of hexadecimal number that is a b so now finally we'll discuss how to convert hexadecimal fraction into decimal so here we are having a b dot 8 c that is an, an hexadecimal number and so as we have already done the integral part of the hexadecimal number that is a b we have already converted a b into decimal equivalent now we'll start um, the conversion of 8c into 6 uh, into the uh, decimal now we have to start with the uh, same procedure that is 8 the first digit from the left side 8 into the base of the hexadecimal that is 16 minus uh, to the power of minus 1 plus c means the value of c is 12 so we have to multiply 12 
into 16 to the power of minus 2 and now the result is 8 divide by 16 plus 12 divide by 16 power 2 that is 256 Now, if you will divide 8 by 16, then the result will be 0 0.5 and 12 divided by 256, the result will be 0 0.0 Four six eight seven and five, and the sum is zero point five four six. 8, 7, and 5. So the final result of that hexadecimal fraction is 171.5468 8 7 and 5 so that is the decimal equivalent of hexadecimal fractional number so that is all about how we can convert other bases to uh, decimal number system so if you people are having